Uh, this is my Alice Chalmers 110 B110 tractor uh, alternator welder. It's made from a Ford Explorer alternator, about 100 amps right here, at uh, 92 volts. I took out the voltage regulator right there. You only have to hook up one of those pins. Uh, this is the positive, and the negative is any ground. And uh, I had the field exciter coming in here, and uh, it's chain driven off the front PTO of my tractor. I made this little holder for it to sit on. Um, the wheels can still pivot on the front while this still is working. Um, I have a panel of uh, switches. I could run angle grinders, drills, anything that uses uh, that's not brush brushless because those are AC. I can only do brushed. And uh, yeah, I have these leads coming down to a ground clamp and electrode holder. Um, welding cable is so expensive and I found a better alternative. Um, if you get yourself a cheap pair of jumper cables, if you cut off the ends, you can hook up your uh, electrode holder and ground clamp and they're rated up to a few hundred amps because they're for jump starting cars. So, that was smart. Uh, here's my tractor and I'm going to start it up. You won't be able to hear me, but I'm going to show you some video. Uh, that was uh, very uncomfortable. I tried to put my phone in my welding helmet so I wouldn't destroy it from the welding light, but uh, I hope I caught that on video. Um, I'm just going to chip the slag away at that weld. I mean... It's can't get it to focus, but there's some holes in there and stuff. I just think that's my fault for uh the angle and everything I'm holding it at. Um let's try that again actually. I'll be uh right back.
I'm sorry you guys couldn't see any of that, but I didn't want to uh, risk the camera from breaking, so I ran three quarters of the electrode. Um, yeah. I'm going to let that cool down a little bit, get a wire brush, and uh, chip the slag. Literally, I don't know what's up, but I think whatever this alternator is running it at, it's on perfect settings because the slag falls off by itself. Literally, just give it like a small tap. I'm gonna hammer. Um. There you go. I mean, that's okay. I could work a lot nicer, but that's what I could do for the video. Um, actually, there's some welds on uh, this side. Um, these are some that I was just messing around, uh, just messing around. Uh, that one's pretty decent. I don't know. But, uh, for an alternator welder, that runs pretty good. So, uh, that's it, guys. See ya.